So today we're going to talk about telling time. All right. So we're going to start our time unit. Um, on our clock, we have two different hands. All right. So the first one, we have a small one, and then we have a long one. So the first one is our, our hour hand, and that's out of the two hands, it only has four letters, H-O-U-R. So that's a small word. So it's a small hand. Another one is our minute hand. And M-I-N-U-T-E. So there's six letters. So that one's a longer word. So that's the longer hand. Another way you can always think about it is little kids always like to go first. When you, Who wants to line up first? Everybody does. So the little hand always goes first. All right. So this is our hour hand and this is our minute hand. Now hopefully you remember some of this from first grade. We know that when the hour hand is pointing at a number and the big hand is pointing straight up at the 12, that's the o'clock. So this would be nine o'clock. This would be four o'clock, two o'clock, ten o'clock, seven o'clock, one o'clock, five o'clock. So anywhere the little hand goes, that hour, and then we have the o'clock. Okay? The next hand, when we use our minute hand, when it goes all the way down at the bottom, that is, <coughs> excuse me, that's our 30. Now, with our hour hand, it has to go in between the two hours, okay? This hand, if we started at the 12 at the o'clock, it is halfway around a circle. So this hand has to be halfway between the numbers. So this would be 130. Because if you drew this line straight ahead, it's not to the two yet. This would be 330. This would be, which one would it be? If I drew my hand out, would it be a 7 or an 8? You're right, it should be 730 because it's not to the 8 yet. What about this one? What would that be? Would that be 10 or 1130? You're right, it's 1030 because if we extended this hand, it's not to the 11 yet. All right, I think you probably already knew that, but I wanted to do a real short, quick review before you start this page. And then tomorrow, we, if everybody does well today, then we'll move right on to counting by fives.